The group's chairman noted with satisfaction the good work Liberty Media is playing in educating and public enlightenment in Bero's space of life. He urged it not to relent in the effort. He advised the station to create special programs that will sensitize on the importance of girl-child education to enable them contribute positively in nation building. Suggest which everybody knows that Liberty is the one among all the best media so far in the North that is contributing to the peace and stability of this country itself. Other members of the delegation also spoke on the need for parents to allow their daughters to acquire Western education. Empowering the youth to help them to know that yes, they are on their own. But when a child is living unempowered, he don't have what to sustain himself, he will be thinking of where will I go to steal. Talk of Northern unity. To those of us who are educated with taxpayers' money, it is a duty and mandatory on us to give our contribution. Because the rate at which the Northern state is being torn apart, apart politically is not good for anybody who knows what not was before yesterday? In some instance, if you go to some schools these days, you will find out that even the women contribute more to see their daughter being married out at the early stage. Because whoever comes in makes that impossible. Responding, the acting general manager of the station, Abdulkari Sanliri, assured the Bistin team of good working relationship with the station. People need to be educated and informed about uh, the dangers of some of their actions. Mm. Okay. The Bistos were later conducted around the operational area of the station. Mohamed Idris, Liberty News.